Good morning, happy Tuesday. I almost said transfer Tuesday. <laughs> uh, if you watch my finance video, then you know why. So I am making lunch right now. It's 10 o'clock, 1014. I have a little patty in the air fryer, so if it's loud, I apologize. We are making a big salad. I'm going to work at 11 and I'm just doing data analysis with two ladies on my team. Uh, so I, yeah, I did, I'm not doing any research today, but I'm very, very hungry. So this is gonna be for once I get to work, I'll, I'll probably eat when we're talking. I don't know, is that rude? But I did just want to, I don't know, because I was in kind of a, not a rut, I wouldn't say whatsoever. I've been really busy. And I said this in my last vlog, I think, but I do want to vlog because I feel like there's not enough YouTubers that are just vlogging normal lives because I know for sure the people that I watch are influencers or, you know, they just, yeah, they, they do YouTube full time and most people aren't working a nine to five job or whatever you want to call it, a full time job. The only person I watch that does that is lipsticks and lattes. The, her name is Grace and she's like a lawyer, an attorney, whatever. So I do watch her and I think it's just interesting to see how people live like a, <laughs> a mundane life, like I do. Not, I wouldn't say mundane, that's a little harsh. But you know, compared to an influencer's life who's like traveling all the time or podcasting with celebrities and just gets to do whatever all day, which is great, that's awesome. Like, yeah, I would love that. I'm sure many people would, but Right now, that's just not my reality. So I wanted to continue to just vlog. And the other thing is that I am trying to make life more exciting just by thinking certain ways and just by doing things more, you know, like finding enjoyment in the little things like coffees or, you know, having more fun on the weekend. Me and Sebastian are trying to be more intentional about that. So if you saw my last vlog, we like, did a whole bunch on the weekend. I just, I yeah, life goes so fast. And, you know, after I had all my health issues, it's like, I just kind of want to live, you know? Have more fun in life and do more things and appreciate that, not just work and waste time on, you know, when I'm home. I'm pretty sure this is the first time in my career since getting my job in 2018 that I have worn sandals to work because I know 100% I don't have to do research in the lab. These are brand new. I got them, I don't know, like two months ago. I had, I purchased these like three years ago in, in pink. They're from Target, the brand A New Day, and they finally went on sale a couple months ago. I haven't worn them yet though. I got them in black and leopard print. Um, so I'm kind of excited to just wear some slides to work for the first time ever. My outfit's pretty basic, just jeans. And then with these, this, uh, I don't know what I'm saying. A gray top, jeans, and these slides. I'm so hungry. I had a cold brew this morning. Uh, no, I don't know. I, I have it in the fridge, the Starbucks iced coffee and it has more, I don't know, it hits me harder than anything else, but I'm shaking. So this is my giant salad. There are tons of greens in there. Uh, I made dressing. Let me put, putting a Dr. Prager's greens patty on top. Okay, I'm back home. It's 1.30, so only spent a couple of hours at work. I'm really hungry. The salad wasn't enough. Have I shown my room yet with the curtains? I don't know, but it's great. Okay, it is 4.20, it is gym time. I took a power nap and I finished editing my video. Got that up, my Transfer Tuesday video, and now I'm gonna go train back and biceps. It's 
far as the gym goes, I've basically been back to normal. Just I'm not doing squats and I'm not doing like conventional deadlifts. So, okay, I am not a, aside from MacBooks and iMacs, I'm not an Apple fan. Like I don't like the phones and I think these were a gift for, these were from Sebastian's dad for Christmas, which obviously I appreciate it. But like, I just don't understand. They don't hold the charge for shit. And then even sometimes I'll charge them and then they will like die the same day or one of them doesn't charge. I just don't get it. I don't understand. The, like I literally charged these yesterday and okay, now it's not even lighting up. So are they dead? I don't freaking know. They just lit up red. It's working. So let's see if this one is. They're working for now, so time to go train. I'm making dinner. It's probably ready. We've got high protein tofu, some rice, tomatoes, made it into a scramble. I always use, I've showed this so many times, but I always use nutritional yeast, garlic powder, and plenty of turmeric. Follow your heart feta crumbles and there we have it that's dinner it is storming right now it stormed yesterday have i even vlogged today i don't know but it's 4 47 on wednesday and i'm about to do abs i'm honestly pretty sore from yesterday my, my biceps, like I can't even um, straighten my arms all the way because they're so sore. And my legs are a little bit sore too. So I'm still trying to get back into weightlifting regularly, which I have been, but there are, I'm still getting really sore. My body's still getting used to it. So I think I'm just gonna do abs and take a walk outside. Um, I have another meeting tonight at 7.30, so like I can't go later. Uh, which is what I would rather do because um, listen to this. Hey Google, what's the temperature? There is 91 degrees. Due to the current humidity, it feels like it's 100. <sighs> I'm doing a mad fit of 15 minute abs. <laughs> I can link it down below if I remember. I'm finally gonna use my bug spray. I do get bit by things, like you see that? It's a bug bite, I picked at it so I made it worse. For some reason I always get bug bites on this side. That happened last year and I thought I had Lyme disease. <laughs> um, ooh, oh, this smells good. It's pretty strong though. Probably should put this on outside. Let me go on my balcony. Okay, it's kind of sticky. Bringing my fanny pack. I'm gonna fill up my water bottle. I always carry my stun gun. That looks like a flashlight. Well, it's a flashlight and a stun gun. My phone, bring my water bottle because it's hot AF. I'm gonna listen to a podcast, a financial one. I'm not sure yet. Y'all, 
I just came out from a hamstring glute workout. I look like a mess because I am, um, I'm drenched. I am dripping sweat. Like I haven't sweat that much and I don't know how long. It was just like falling off everywhere. And the secret is candy. Um, so not gonna lie, about an hour before working out, I ate a whole bag of sour strips. Um, I still have a few bags left of sour strips from Christmas. So I have been holding off on them for that long. But ideally, when you eat some candy, you don't eat a whole bag of it. But I did today, and I did that the other day. <laughs> but it made me sweat a lot, and I felt pretty energized during my workout. But I had a really good workout. I have so much tonight. I'm going to take a shower. I need to make dinner somehow. I have to call my mom. And then I have a project call at 7.30, a study group call at 9. Um, I did have a client call before the gym at 5 o'clock. And yeah, I'm just, I'm overwhelmed. <laughs> Help. I'm about to go to lunch with my coworkers. One of my leads is retiring she's not i'm not that close to her but i figured i should go here's my outfit i'm wearing these jean shorts that don't really fit me but i was gonna post them on poshmark and never got to it and these sandals um and this i'm walking there because it's right across the street from me luckily and uh i don't want to just carry my phone and stuff out and about by the way this bracelet the company sent me this as a little gift from, you know that moon diffuser I have, the Moonlight Moon Diffuser? Um, that is, it's a collaboration with them and Zen Soul, or they sell this on their website, Zen Soul Jewelry. Came in this little pouch, look how cute. And these, these stones are known for healing, which is pretty cool because y'all know everything I've been through. So I do enjoy wearing it. I think it's really pretty. These are homemade or not homemade, handmade by, I gotta get my facts straight, honestly. It's like stay-at-home moms, I think, and uh, I confirmed that this was vegan leather because to me it smelled real, but she said with the technology they like can make it smell like that. I don't know, but to me it smelled real, but I guess it is vegan leather. Um, it's 100% handmade and unique, so I can link this down below. I think I have a code as well. I think it's like Layla, Layla 10, I don't know, one of those, but I'll put it down below. I have been a horrible vlogger this week, but y'all kind of get the idea here. It's 4 o'clock right now, by the way. I am pouring. Probably shouldn't do this, but I'm going to have coffee on the way to Sebastian's house. And I got my book bag on. Got to bring a bunch. And I figured I would wrap up my video here because I'm not going to bring my camera with me. Um, I will be going to Sebastian's house for the weekend. And actually, I have like a dentist appointment in the city he lives in. On Monday so I'm saying like through Monday some Oatly um but yeah I honestly kind of just feel still like I can't catch my breath and it's my own fault and I'm not like trying to complain about it except I will say that I think I don't know like I read something the other day which I've seen before but it was talking about like how the weekend isn't long enough to take off from to have off from work and somebody had writ written like it's because on the weekends we're not even taking time off we're like doing the laundry and um running errands going grocery shopping etc cetera, etc cetera. and it's like so true uh i don't know i'm just really feeling the effects of like adulthood right now and i love being an adult honestly i love being a responsible person i love you know the things that i do in life and all that but i'm just really feeling some type of way about everything so it's just interesting but yeah I'll be fine a lot of the things that I'm doing right now are temporary not a lot of the things but quite a few things I just feel like there's a lot that I need to catch up on or I've procrastinated on for so long and I'm just trying to give myself grace because this year was has been tough for me and I'm slowly getting there this tastes weird right now gonna wrap it wrap it up here i'll see you when i see you i want to plan out some videos like maybe some sit down videos uh, i feel like i always ask this but let me know what you want to see there are 
videos out there that I know I still need to film, but I just haven't. And I want to get back into blogging. I want August to be a lot healthier than I've been in July, because July was bad in regards to food. Maybe I'll document that, like, getting back on track. How many times can I make a video on that, you know? Okay, I'm going to sign off now. Thank you for watching. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. And I'll see you in my next video.